Hey folks, welcome along to another Missing and Fly video. I hope you're well out and about today on the Tri Trident once again. An absolutely cracking little motorcycle I've been getting to know quite well over the last couple of weeks. And in this video, I'm going to give you five reasons why I think you should consider buying the Triumph Trident. Stick around and stay tuned. Okay, well, welcome along to another video and uh, welcome to beautiful Great Missenden and its 20 mile an hour limit, which is a bit of a pain because this little bike loves to be revved. It sounds absolutely brilliant, but more of that later. In this video, what I'm going to give you are my top five reasons why I think you should consider buying this particular motorcycle. It's a very uh, competitive segment, this, things like MT-07, CBR650, lots of bikes uh, potentially competing for your money, but what makes a Triumph Triumph so special? Why should you consider this? Well, uh, if you're in the market for one of these, stick around and stay tuned, I'll tell you what I think. So the first of my reasons as to what makes this a very definite consideration is its value for money. This bike at the moment comes in at £7,195 here in the UK and you get an awful lot of bike for your money. Not only do you get the beautiful sound in 660cc triple and Triumph's brilliant build quality these days, you get an amazing TFT, you get riding modes, switchable traction control. Basically, the bike has much better build quality and facilities available than the price would have you believe. When Triumph launched this machine, they said that it was better priced and had better facilities than all its main competitors. And uh, having had a look at those now and ridden a few of them, I tend to agree. So that's the first reason why it's worth considering. It's brilliantly priced. Okay, on to the second reason why I think this bike is worth considering. I'll demonstrate it. I've got a clear patch here. Just listen to this engine. Now you probably couldn't hear that very well through the microphone, but uh, the bike of course is a triple. Triumph know how to make triple engine motorcycles. They've made some crackers in the past, notably things like the street triple, the speed triple, and now the new Trident as well. The engines are just smooth, they give you the best of both worlds, they give you the grunt of a twin, but the uh, speed and smoothness of a four cylinder just in that sweet spot. So that's the second reason why you should consider the Triumph Trident. The brilliant sounding triple engine. Okay, on to my third reason why you should uh, seriously consider this bike if you're in the market for a mid-sized naked machine. And that, in my mind, is one of the most important things about a motorcycle. And that, in the case of the Trident, is the handling. It just feels light and agile. Through these back lanes here, you can just chuck it about with great ease. There's nothing ponderous about the bike. Nothing difficult about riding it. It's just got beautiful handling. The suspension on here, it's not adjustable or complicated, but it's just set right for me. I'm a medium sized fella. 5 foot 8, 72 kilograms, that's 11 stone in the old money. And for me, the bike just feels right out of the factory. So that's the third reason why I think you should consider look at the Triumph Trident. Its handling is just sublime. Okay, on to the fourth reason then. And this is something that I often criticise new Triumphs about, but in this bike, they've got it absolutely right. What am I talking about? This thing here that you're looking at all the time. The TFT on this is absolutely cracking. I'm going to make a video just on the TFT, actually, because I think it warrants it, and a lot of people have asked me about it. But the thing looks like a jewel. It's a beautiful, clear TFT. It's got everything on there you need, including a gear position indicator, a proper fuel gauge, and lots more besides. As I say, I'll make a separate video about that soon, so stay tuned to the channel if you want to know more about the TFT. And that's the fourth reason why I think the Trident is worth considering. The TFT on here is just beautiful. Okay, on to the fifth reason why this bike is worth you considering spending your money on. And I'll demonstrate that again. Here we are, look. Second gear, 30 miles an hour. 60. There we go. It is absolutely, incredibly fast at real world speeds, if that makes sense. The low down grunt and torque on this bike is absolutely superb. Triumph for Pride played a blinder tuning this bike so all it's go and shove is low down in the rev range at real world speeds. 
So if you're not going to be going on track days and you're not uh, going to be herring around at 100 miles an hour everywhere, this bike is absolutely perfect because it's a thrilling ride, even at slow speeds, from 0 to 60 miles an hour as you saw there, which it arrives at very quickly indeed. The thing just flies. The grunt and torque of this engine is the top thing that I like about the bike and it's one reason, a great reason, why I think you should consider the Triumph Trident as a potential purchase. I've ridden some of its competitors, MT-07, CBR650, neither of those to me feel as fast as this does in the uh, lower speed regime from, as I say, 0 to 70, say. So yeah, yeah, that's uh, five reasons why I think you should consider the Triumph Trident if you're in the market for a mid-sized naked motorcycle. There's so many good reasons to buy this bike. It just makes an awful lot of sense. If you want to know more about the Trident, have a look through my channel. Loads more videos on here, including my in-depth review that will be coming very soon about what it's like to live with this bike, where I talk about not only the good things about the motorcycle, but the bad things too. No motorcycle is perfect, and this is no exception. Having said that, it is very, very good. Well, that's it for now. I look forward to speaking to you again soon. Until then, this has been the Mr. Fly. Cheerio.